So in yesterday's video, when I gave you guys the 12 best class setups, I asked you guys if you wanted to know the best specialists as well. And now that's what we're following up with here in today's video. We just gonna play a couple games. I'm gonna give you guys my top three and then give you guys some honorable mentions later on. So hopefully you guys do enjoy these games where I show you guys actual gameplay and break down these specialists and why they're the best in my opinion. Uh, make sure you guys drop a like on this video, subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new. Hopefully you guys are having fun on BO4. Let's get right into the gameplay though. Look at the lobby. I'm telling you, you can tell BO4 is free right now for the PlayStation. Jesus Christ, but number one, or not not number one, number three spe Is this real life? Number three specialist is uh Reaper. He got his little scythe minigun or whatever you want to call it. He uh has the Reaper Shroud, which is basically like a little jammer that you can put on the map. How you guys doing? I'm about to put mine, honestly, right here. Oh, that was perfect, because somebody just threw a zero grenade, which is an EMP. As soon as I did my stuff. What is that man doing? Yeah, but the Reaper Shroud, as long as you, like, are in that area, just throw in, like, a high traffic area, and a spot that's kind of, like, hard for them to take it out, and you can literally just use it as a jammer. Unless they have, like, engineer, and they can easily find your equipment. Or zero. They throw that EMP grenade, and then... That's a rip in the chat. This man jumping through windows. What are you doing? I'm trying to get my scythe right now, though. Who got that? Get that out of here. That man just put the hawk randomly right there. That was kind of stupid. UAV. We're playing kill confirmed right now, though. This is... I've never seen this many level ones, bro. Ever on Black Ops 4. I'm glad that this game went free to play because these next couple of uh, weeks are going to be <laughs> crazy for the lobbies, bro. Besides these people using... Um, Weird spots, just sitting in bushes and stuff. Gonna really run away? Let me get out of the middle of the map. Let me get out of the middle of the map. Not the best spot I can be. Get this man, teammate, you can't aim. They using all the weird specialists, bro. That's one thing I'm gonna hate. Seeing these people use Nomad. As soon as they find out about that, that's gonna be hell. Nomad, Torque, Fire Break. Like, there's so many annoying specialists in this game. Ooh, teammate. I just don't understand what my teammates be doing. We got this minigun now. All you gotta do is really spray. The only downsides to this specialist is that when you use this minigun, you gotta like prime it. So that it can, you know. It's like basically like a machine gun. I think I don't know what the proper term is. You gotta like I think it's a, it starts with the R. But basically you gotta warm it up before you shoot it or like aim down sight. It's not like automatic with the response. And then another downside with uh, Reaper is that he's a robot. So obviously his footsteps are going to be louder than everybody else. So unless you're using Dead Silence, which I don't use really that much on this game, you're going to be heard kind of easily if they're using the headset. I'm using Reaper Shroud to my advantage. I always thought that Reaper Shroud is like the area of effect is crazy. And let me not push that way because they are sniping. Let's go around. Let's be smart. I don't know why they still outside if I got a uh, a sniper nest. They living life on the edge. Come on, teammate. What are we doing back here? Look at these noobs and how they just having a fight. They not even shooting. They trying to melee each other. Got another sniper nest. Let's just keep punishing them. They took away arms race TDM conveniently as soon as uh this game went free. Damn, teammate. We on a relentless right now. Okay. See if we can get our scythe to get this nuclear. That would be perfect. He was actually a DLC specialist, if you guys didn't know. He got added like, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Like midway into um BO4. He was in BO3, obviously, like I said before. But I feel like he's better. In That's exactly what I didn't want to see. That is literally the last thing I wanted to see. Nomad specialist is the easiest thing for the enemy team to use. Please don't kill me, please. I'm getting shot from the dude. No, I'm dead. Go, 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 go. I'm dead. Yeah, the, the dog is literally like the most annoying specialist. You can't do anything, bro. Here we go again. I can never get a nuclear in this game now, bro. It's just like something always stupid that is happening. It's either the game ends too fast or a specialist. That man's AFK. All right, here we go. Scythe. I just want them all to spawn in the same spot so I can just 
Show you how me spraying this thing down. They gotta be back here. Okay. Why is he over here? So they spawning back here. I don't really know. Okay, they spawned to the left. Perfect. I cannot aim today. I don't know what's going on. I'm trying my best, but it's not looking too good, man. Usually I'm able to get, you know, quad feeds and stuff with this, but most of these people AFK, they just sitting in corners. It's kind of hard to showcase, but that Reaper shot is deadly because it makes your enemies nervous. They don't know what to expect, especially if you're using like an unsilenced or unsuppressed weapon and they're trying to look at their radar. They ain't going to be able to tell where you're coming from because you got it jammed. Fight! Oh my god, this is another- look at Nomad, bro. 80 and 6, I guess that's alright, it was just too shaky, bro. Like, I don't know, I use Scythe depending on the map. I thought this would be a good one, but the way they was moving was weird. There's too much cover. Like, for a map that's kind of like open, Scythe is really good because you can just spray the enemies down. I mean, I guess this spawn right here was good, but they just was barely spawning back there. We got a few kills with the Scythe, though. Alright, here we go. TDM on slums. We're using uh, Seraph now. She actually has her Annihilator pistol and Cold War as a kill streak. So if you play that, you're familiar with that. She was also in BO3. And she's in this game. In this game, she got a spawn beacon, right? So, I'll, like, that's her specialist equipment. Who is shooting me through a wall? They cheating on this game. God damn. I know he's not using what I think he's using. Okay. I got. I literally have my best class setups lined up, so we can do exactly that. I don't got a problem with that. How did he know I was coming from behind? These people are acting brand new. Oh, behind. Mm-hmm. I'm telling you. Don't make me pull out the auger. That's not. A, that's something you don't want to do. We got our spawn. Oh, here's the auger, man. Inside here, teammate. Uh-huh. We could do the same thing. I ain't gonna lie. It's gonna be fun today. Wait till I get my streaks, but the spawn beacon, what I use it as is if my teammates don't want to push out the spawn. I can force them to push out the spawn by, oh my God, almost getting grenaded, but making them spawn on me. But that, I'm we can do the same thing, bro. It's basically going to be like, who can aim first? That's all this is going to be. Push up. Mind your business. They not minding their business today, so I guess we're just going to have to take advantage of that. I'm dead. Uh-huh. Nope. This dude behind don't even realize what's going on. <laughs> this sweaty ass boy. I don't know. Some of these low levels are definitely people that played this game before. Or they just generally just sweats. Because they acting out of pocket with what I'm seeing so far. And now my sniper that's about to whoop that ass now. It's not so fun, is it? What's happening? What you doing? I don't know if he knew what he was doing. I'm not going to lie. How you doing, my brother? And we got the Annihilator, too. Okay. So the only thing with the Annihilator is that you got to be accurate. Um, like, really accurate. It's like a one-shot pistol. Like, I mean, like, one shot. No matter what you do, they are dead. So if you got the accuracy, like how I'm about to show you right now. Where they at? <laughs> like how I'm about to show you right now is about to be dangerous. Oh my, we just got a collateral, I think. We got zeroed, so we can't see what's going on. No, man, the grenade. Oh my god, the specialist versus specialist, man. I'm tired of suffering. Actually, they got a spawn beacon in the middle. I can show you guys some more Annihilator action. Where they at? They over here? Take that armor off. It's time. They all right here. Bang. Bang. Come on. Bring more. Don't run. Come back. That's okay. Yeah. <laughs> oh man when you get the class that's the most satisfying and you hit fire a couple times here and there move through the smoke <laughs> Yo. oh my god man that man got embarrassed call this in oh teammate what you love it's me yeah that tempest it caused damage too i got you teammate i got the revenge yeah but basically i just send my spawn beacon middle map that's like the best strategy Put it in like a corner or something where the enemies can't really destroy it. And you're good to go. But 65 and 6, I take that. Second favorite specialist in the game, Seraph. You guys seen, my favorite part is that pistol, man. Like, if you can use the spawn beacon really good, then you can really set your teammates up for like distractions. But 
this right here <laughs> you can't top this bro especially if you're accurate with this thing it is the deadliest thing ever popped him too that was the perfect shot it was that all this cover in the way all right here we go man we back with the number one specialist in my opinion profit you get a free to kill or yeah basically free kill every time you get your uh specialist equipment which is the secret drone freezes the enemy in place unless they hit uh, a prompt literally at the time they get shocked which is very unlikely if they don't see it coming Got this swordfish out. Oh my god, I forgot how disgusting this thing is, man. And then we also got the Tempest. So if the enemies are playing right next to each other, they want to play the buddy-buddy hold their hand system, that's the best specialist for it, because it's free multi-kills. I feel like they're going to be over here. Yep. First, why did I have a feeling it was, whoa, whoa, it was going to be over here. UAV. Oh wait, my teammate, I got you. Oh, he got a crossbow. That's the Reaver. Bang. You deserve to get shot just because of what you're using. I see the vibes with... You ain't die. You man, try to run away. It ain't time to run. He down the hallway, teammate. I seen him. They all on this side, actually. Nah, you stuck. <laughs> you gonna have to fight, my guy. I got you. I'm gonna defend you. I'm trying to defend you, at least. Oh, my God. This swordfish is nasty. The guy right here. Come on. Hit that head glitch. The man, lagging. Okay. But yeah, as you guys can see, that seeker drone is... uh. It's dangerous. You better come up on the Tempest right now. Alright, he... Yep. Tempest time. That other guy got shocked in there, by the way. I know that, but... Just had to go for these people over here. You ain't get... Okay, there we go. That's the chain reaction I was looking for. Call my UAV in, as you guys can see. You wanna play buddy-buddy? This is exactly what's going... Make it easy. If they are playing buddy buddy. Oh, I hit the other dude. I didn't even know I hit him. This is crazy, bro. Oh, there's there's more. Oh no 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 no. Nope, teammate. They are all there. They really are playing buddy buddy. Like I've never seen this many buddies before. Oh, and he's strafing you. Let me get up out of here, bro. <laughs> oh my goodness, man. I should throw my strike team. Oh, they still got that right there. The barbed wire. Damn, I'm kind of stuck then. The secret tripping out. Sometimes they can do that where it just spin around in the circle, but usually it'll lead you to the right destination, which is a free kill. Whoa. Yeah, okay. Don't be on the head glitch. Strike team, you go that way. Tell me what you see. Yeah, they all just getting sniper nest. I can't find nobody. I just want to find... Oh, I hear somebody. I heard that. Put that down. All right, yeah. Let me not call my next set of streaks because the sniper nest is just... <laughs> The best set of streaks you hear right here. Sniper Nest, Strike Team, uh, and UAV. I said that in the wrong order, but it's okay. It don't matter. They really just sitting in the back trying to destroy the Sniper Nest. That's the funniest part. You can tell we playing against noobs. All right. Easy kill. Basically, that's what Secret Mind means. Okay, this guy in the back. What is he doing? Climb through the window. Oh, that man got <laughs> destroyed by a teammate. And somebody fell off the map. Okay, can this Sniper Nest go away? Thing. A thing to save ammo. Let me show you guys real quick. Where'd he go? Oh. All you want to do is just melee him. And that's how you can save ammo. Instead of just... I was about to die right there. That man had his sword out. Oh, I got a nuclear. <laughs> I didn't even know I was that close to the nuclear. I ain't gonna lie to you, but... There you go right there. Come on, I want them all to be together so I can... I mean, I already showed you guys a good example, but... If they are all together... You've seen it in my previous videos if you watched it. I use Tempest a lot, so all you gotta do is just click on another BO4 video. It's usually the first specialist that I end up using. And man, AFK, I take that. Got the unstoppable medals coming up. Jesus Christ, that man did not want to die. Uh, oh wait. Okay, let's go for another little uh, 80 kill TDM maybe. I didn't even know we was doing that good. This could be better than the last one. Hopefully they don't push the right. Oh, look at that timing. I'm glad I waited. Ooh. No, no, no. There's a shield right there. Chase me. God damn, he just kept spraying. I hate when people do that. Damn. Okay, wait, wait, no. We only die one time still. Keep the KD. Yeah, come on, come on. Yeah, stack up. There you go, strike team. Yeah, there you go. Uh-huh. Straight, I mean, uh, seeker. Come on, we gotta go for another 80 kill. Oh, no, we can't. Damn. If we didn't die, we probably could've did it. I can't believe that man just held that angle like that. That was disrespectful. 
I expected him to like get nervous or something, maybe. Oh, here's the man again. Just sitting there spraying, bro. This dude don't care. Let's go for a 75 minimum. Oh, I seen him do that. Nope. Look at the timing, bro. And guess who happy? Me! Damn, man. Can I get 75? Did I get a... Oh, yeah, okay. We can't get 75, but we got another 70 kill TDM, whatever. Could have got 80 because, you know, we got a whole lot of noobs on this game and not that great players, but that's the Tempest right there. Wish I could have did more with it but you know we got a nuclear so i guess that's cool i'm in a minute since we got one of those okay so if we go over to the specialist menu we covered three of these people already but the other two that are honorable mentions for me that are really good that are in my top five are for one recon it's really good for if you don't really know the maps uh the thing is what you want to do with the recon dart which is basically kind of like a a shootable portable radar if that makes any sense put it in places that uh, the enemies can't destroy it. Just like the Reaper shot, how we talked about that earlier. Vision pulse, you can literally see enemies through walls and stuff like that, really helpful. Uh, and then the next one I would recommend is Crash. Assault pack will help you get your streaks really fast uh, once you pick that up. And then TAC-5 obviously will give you up to 200 health. So, so that also is a pretty useful specialist. Now I kind of tend to stay away from everything else. I mean, Spectre, if you want to have fun, you can use a sword and slash everybody up. But um, the, those five right there are like in my main rotation. Everything else is kind of looked at as like a noob specialist. I mean, Rune is pretty decent too. I'm not even gonna see here a lot, especially for objective game modes, but everything else is kind of looked at as like a newbie sort of specialist. But yeah, man, those are the top specialists in my opinion for those new people hopping on Black Ops 4 now that it's free on PlayStation Plus. Uh, let me know what you guys think, man. Let me know what your favorite is in the comment section down below. Drop a like on this video. Subscribe to the channel if you guys are brand new, man. Drop the nice little nuclear and the 70 kill TDM for you guys in this video. Uh, make sure you guys follow my second channel, Lone Wolf XP2. We're less than like 20-something subscribers away from 1,000, so get over there. Tune into that for other games that aren't on this channel. And the uh, rest of my social media is linked in the description, man. I'll see you guys all in the next one. Peace.